Apple has become the world's first company to hit a $3 trillion stock market value yesterday as investors are bullish on iPhone makers' future prospects and are hopeful that the U.S. firm will keep launching best-selling products. However, after touching record high in Monday trade, Apple slipped and ended the day a tad below the record high market value. Now, it was the first trading day of the new year when the Silicon Valley company shares hit an intraday record high of $182.88, but slipped and ended the session up 2.5% at $182.01. Apple shares have climbed around 5,800% since the co-founder and former chief executive Steve Jobs unveiled the first iPhone in January 2007, far outpacing the S&P 500's gain of about 230% during the same period. Now, Apple has sharply increased its revenue from services like video streaming and music. That helped Apple reduce its reliance on the iPhone to about 52% of total revenue in fiscal 2021, from over 60% in 2018. Pleasing investors are worried the company relied too much on its top selling product. Now, Apple is already dominating the world's largest smartphone market, China, where iPhone sales continue to beat rivals such as Vivo and Xiaomi for the second straight month. Now, to keep up the momentum, Apple is exploring new markets and new technologies such as automated cars and virtual reality. Still, some investors worry that Apple is hitting the limits of how much it can expand its user base and how much cash it can squeeze from each user. And also, there is no guarantee that the future product categories will prove as lucrative as the iPhone. Now, with Apple trying to enter into Tesla's territory, which plans to launch an electric vehicle, analysts are skeptical about Apple's new move in a completely uncharted territory. We are now available in your country. Download the app now. Get all the news on the move.